Move, align, and distribute objects. Move objects. You can move objects by dragging them with specific tools, by using the arrow keys on the keyboard, or by entering precise values in a panel or dialog box. You can use snapping to help you position objects as you move them. For example, you can snap the pointer to guides and anchor points and snap object boundaries to grid lines. You can also use the align panel to position objects in relation to each other. You can then use the shift key to constrain the movement of one or more objects so that they move in a precise horizontal, vertical, or diagonal direction relative to the current orientation of the X and Y axes. You can also use the shift key to rotate objects in multiples of 45 degrees. Move or duplicate an object by pasting. Select one or more objects. Choose Edit Cut to move the selection or Edit Copy to duplicate the selection. To paste an object into another file, open the file. Choose one of the following commands. Edit Paste. Pastes the object into the center of the active window. Edit Paste in front. Pastes the object directly in front of the selected object. Edit Paste in back. Pastes the object directly in back of the selected object. Edit Paste in place. Pastes artwork on the active artboard at the same position as the artboard from where the artwork is copied. Edit Paste on all artboards. Pastes artwork on all the artboards at the same location where the artwork is on the current artboard. Move an object using the arrow keys. Select one or more objects. Press the arrow key for the direction in which you want to move the object. Press Shift plus arrow to move the object 10 times the value specified by the keyboard increment preference. The distance the object moves each time you press an arrow key is determined by the keyboard increment preference. The default distance is 1.172 of an inch or 0.3528 millimeter. To change the keyboard increment preference, choose Edit Preferences General, Windows, or Illustrator Preferences General, Mac OS. Move an object by a specific distance. Select one or more objects. Choose Object Transform Move. Note. When an object is selected, you can also double-click the Selection, Direct Selection, or Group Selection tool to open the Move dialog box. Do any of the following. To move the object left or right, enter either a negative value, moves left, or a positive value, moves right, in the horizontal text box. To move the object up or down, enter either a negative value, moves up, or positive value, moves down, in the vertical text box. To move the object by an angle that's relative to the object's x-axis, enter either a positive angle, counterclockwise movement, or a negative angle, clockwise movement, in the distance or angle text box. You can also enter values between 180 degrees and 360 degree. These values are converted to their corresponding negative values. For example, a value of 270 degrees is converted to minus 90 degrees. If the objects contain a pattern fill, select patterns to move the pattern. Please select objects if you want to move the pattern but not the objects. Click OK or click Copy to move a copy of the objects. Move an object using X and Y coordinates. Select one or more objects. In the Transform panel or Control panel, enter new values in either the X or Y text box or both. To change the reference point, Click a white square on the reference point locator before you enter the values. Move multiple objects at once. Select one or more objects. Choose Object Transform, Transform each. Set the distance you want to move the selected objects in the Move section of the dialog box. Do one of the following. To move the objects by the specified amounts, click OK. To move the objects randomly, 
but no more than the specified amounts, select the random option. For example, if you draw a brick wall and want the bricks to appear slightly offset from each other instead of perfectly aligned, you could select the random option. Then click OK. Paste in place and paste on all artboards. The paste in place command pastes artwork on the active artboard. To use this command, click edit paste in place. The keyboard shortcut is Control plus Shift plus V, Windows, or CMD plus Shift plus V, Mac. The Paste on All Artboards command pastes the selected artwork on all the artboards. Before using the Paste on All Artboards command, make sure that the artboard from which you are copying the object is the active artboard. To use the Paste on All Artboards command, click Edit Paste on All Artboards when you cut or copy the artwork. If you copy artwork and then select Paste on all artboards, the artwork is repasted on the artboard from where it is copied. Recommended, cut and then paste objects if you do not need to modify the original objects before using the Paste on all artboards command. Note, Paste in place and Paste on all artboards commands paste the object at the same position as the copied objects referenced from the active artboard at the time of copying. Align and Distribute Objects You use the Align Panel, Window Align, and the Align options in the Control Panel to align or distribute selected objects along the axis you specify. You can use either the Object Edges or Anchor Points as the reference point, and you can align to a selection, an artboard, or a key object. A key object is one specific object in a selection of multiple objects. The Align options are visible in the Control Panel when an object is selected. If they do not appear, choose Align from the Control Panel menu. Note, by default, Illustrator calculates alignment and distribution based on the object's paths. However, when working with objects that have different stroke weights, you can use the edge of the stroke to calculate alignment and distribution instead. To do this, Select Use Preview Bounds from the Align Panel menu. Align or distribute relative to the bounding box of all selected objects. Select the objects to align or distribute. In the Align Panel or Control Panel, select Align to Selection, and then click the button for the type of alignment or distribution you want. Thanks for watching at Master Channel.